Robert Wagner has established himself as one of Hollywood's most outstanding actors of his generation. With several decades of career, Wagner has amassed fame, fortune, and a devoted fanbase. It is only natural to wonder about Robert Wagner's net worth and salary. What is Robert Wagner's net worth and salary 2023? Robert Wagner, a well-known American actor, has a net worth of 20 million United States dollars. Wagner had a remarkable acting career that spanned six decades. He is most recognized for his appearances in hit TV shows such as, Heart to Heart, It Takes a Thief, and, Switch, and his depiction as Teddy Leopold in, Two and a Half Men. Robert Wagner Overview Early Life Robert John Wagner Jr., February 10, 1930, was in Detroit, Michigan. Hazel, his mother, worked as a telephone operator. Robert Sr.'s father was a traveling salesman who made a little fortune supplying paint to the automotive industry and lacquer to Ford for use on their dashboards. When he was seven years old, his family moved to Los Angeles. His father had obviously amassed sufficient wealth to retire in sunny Southern California. They even spent over a year custom building a home in Bel Air overlooking the Bel Air Country Club. Robert Jr. was sent to California before the rest of the family. He was loaded onto a train by himself and actually hauled out of the Hollywood Military Academy. Robert would attend four separate military schools in Southern California, and many of his classmates were famous stars' children. Wagner graduated in 1949 from St. Monica Catholic School. Career Robert Wagner, a versatile and accomplished American actor, has enjoyed a long and distinguished career in the entertainment industry, spanning over six decades. Wagner's journey into the world of acting began with inspiration from his job at the Bel Air Country Club, where he caddied for stars like Clark Gable. After a one-year ultimatum from his father to find success in Hollywood or join the steel business, Wagner made his mark in the industry with an uncredited film debut in The Happy Years, 1950. With a song in my heart, 1952, he earned prominence as a shell-shocked soldier, and he went on to star in films such as A Kiss Before Dying, 1956, The Pink Panther, 1963, Harper, 1966, The Towering Inferno, 1974, and The Concord. Airport, 79, 1979. Wagner's career also flourished on television, with memorable roles in popular series like Heart to Heart, 1979-1984, and, Switch, 1975-1978, where he co-starred with Eddie Albert, Sharon Gless, and Charlie Callis. His friendship with Albert began in the early 1960s and continued until Albert's death in 2005. In more recent years, Wagner portrayed Anthony Dinozo Sr. on the hit show, NCIS. Throughout his career, Wagner has demonstrated an impressive ability to adapt to various roles and genres, showcasing his talent in both film and television. Wagner and Wood established their own production firm, Rona Productions, in 1961. Wagner and Steve McQueen filmed The War Lover in England in 1962. Wagner moved to Europe for a few years after his divorce from Wood. There, he played in The Longest Day, The Condemned of Altona, and The Pink Panther, the latter of which was a huge smash in 1963, but Wagner's role was so insignificant that he was largely disregarded. As Alexander Mundy in the hit series, It Takes a Thief, in the late 1960s, he landed the first of three parts that would propel him to stardom. From 1968 through 1970, the show aired on ABC. This was his comeback, and he received an Emmy nomination for Best TV Actor for his work with Fred Astaire. Despite facing personal challenges and tragedies, including being named a person of interest in the investigation into Wood's death in 2018, Wagner has remained a respected figure in Hollywood. His lasting impact as an actor reflects his talent, versatility, and devotion to his trade. Personal life. Wagner claimed to have had affairs with Joan Crawford, Elizabeth Taylor, Joan Collins, and other well-known entertainers in his memoirs. In December 1957, he married Natalie Wood, and they divorced in 1962. In July 1963, Wagner married Marion Marshall and had one daughter, Katie. In 1971, they divorced. Wagner was engaged to Tina Sinatra from 1970 until 1972. After their engagement ended, Wagner rekindled his affection with Wood, and they remarried on July 16, 1972. Courtney was their daughter. Why is Robert Wagner famous? 
Robert Wagner's fame stems from his exceptional talent as an actor and his memorable performances in both film and television. His charisma, versatility, and on-screen presence have made him a respected figure in the entertainment industry. From classic films to beloved television shows, Wagner has left an indelible mark on popular culture. FAQs about Robert Wagner. How old was Robert Wagner when he filmed Titanic? He also claimed a four-year love involvement with Barbara Stanwyck after they co-starred in the 1953 film Titanic. Wagner claims that due of their age disparities, he was 22 and she was 45, they kept the romance hidden to avoid jeopardizing their professions. Was Robert Wagner ever James Bond? In a story for the Daily Mail, Robert Wagner discusses the moment he was offered the James Bond role. When I reconnected with Natalie in 1971, producer Cubby Broccoli did me the great honor of suggesting that I portray James Bond. Who was the youngest actor in Titanic? Reese Thompson, who played the Irish little boy in Titanic, said that he is still receiving royalty checks from the iconic film more than two decades after it was released. Thompson was just five years old when he was cast as an Irish third-class child passenger aboard the Titanic. How much does Natalie get paid per episode? If Natalie's work on 90 Day Fiancé is taken into account, In Touch reports that cast members earn $1,000 to $1,500 per episode. How many times did Robert Wagner marry? He is married for the fourth time, having previously married Wood twice. In conclusion, with a career spanning several decades and a legacy that continues to inspire aspiring actors, Wagner has solidified his place in Hollywood history. From his early beginnings to his enduring success, he remains a beloved figure in the hearts of fans around the world. Finally, thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe us to learn more interesting information about celebrities.